Warren, how was it out there? It was um, a good game of football tonight, obviously. Um, thank you to Chartland for uh, giving us an exercise. and I thought we applied ourselves very well against a very, very strong uh, Chartland team. But um, seven minutes in the second half of, of craziness uh, cost us a game. But look, it's building up to where we want to go. Um, I was very pleased. Got 90 minutes onto the majority of the players. And um, I thought there was some good stuff. Um, but we're not going to play a position like that. No disrespect to the rest of the teams in our league. But the pleasing thing was that uh, at times we matched them. And, uh, you know, it was pleased for the good work out. Forget the seven minutes. Um, how proud are you with the rest of them out there because obviously they, they did have a lot of first teamers out there as well so you know oh listen I'm, I'm pleased very pleased I thought you know in the first half we kept our shape very well um, defended well and looked to hit them on the counter attack uh, second half as well we had a couple of chances um, but look the pleasing thing was as I say to build up to where we want to go up to the to two and a half weeks to where we're going to start and uh, as I said it was good to get 90 minutes more or less than everyone this week um, so uh, that was a pleasing point obviously as well we had you know um, trialists again you had trialists from um, the other night as well have any of them impressed you yeah they have well you know we've signed a couple of them don't you um, keep very quiet <laughs> <laughs> so uh, no they have done as I said to you that the, the boys the other night came in they've done very well we're always looking to strengthen um, and I always going to ask the board Obviously, um, if there's right players there now at this time of the season, they've got to be the right ones because, look, there is injuries as well um, that you've got to comply with football. But uh, no, I was pleased with them. And, uh, you know, at the end of the day, we've just got to build on what we did at the end of last season. Getting into this season, you know, I'm hearing already people's talking about, oh, we're favourites this, we're favourites that. I'll just put this clear on camera right now that we've got to be competitive and that's it because of where we finished. Um, we're going in the right direction and uh, as I say we'll let people talk but uh, you know I'm pleased with what I've got so far and um, as I say as a, as a group and as a club I want to do the right things and uh, that's what we've got to do move forward and then moving on um, coming Tuesday will be your first home game of pre-season um, there's been improvements at the ground obviously and there's a new look squad once again are you looking forward to that against Lewis? To be honest, I am, but you know, I'm a, not a great lover of pre-season because you know, it, you've got to do it. You got to get the boys fit, but you just want the season to start and get going because um, it can be false at times. Um, so, no, look, it'll be a good game for us. Good to get at home, I think, to get the fans as well, um, and it's building up to where we want to go in two and a half weeks. Yeah. So we've only got two more left, which is Lewis and Cray Valley. What are you looking for from your team for the next two games? Um, you want to go in this se the start of the season with momentum, um, but as I said, the minutes is the important thing and, and work around with, with what, what, what way we want to play and look at um, how can we affect teams in our way with, with two games to go. Look, it's building up, as I said, to the, the, the fitness, the minutes to sharpen them up now for the next two and a half weeks. And, um, you know, come the, the first game of the season, you know what it's like uh, getting hit with a, a bulldozer because it's 100 mile an hour and that's what we've got to be ready for. Thank you very much, Warren.